Captain Redbeard here, and today uh, we are actually going to open some Pokemon cards. Um, I've been collecting them for a while now, and um, I really thought that this could be something cool to do. Um, kind of wanted to see if maybe I could get some cool cards. Um, I do have some um, some unbroken bonds. Um, these are actually from uh, Doll General. Uh, I was in St. Augustine um, during the weekend and I came across these and they're only a dollar. I mean, why not get them? So um, today we're going to open these and I have a team up uh, tin which I believe is uh, Unified Minds. Uh, card set which these are my favorite um, card sets uh, just because the art styles on them are really nice um, so we're going to start with um, some unbroken bonds packs first so I'm gonna keep that back there and yeah there are 23 so there I believe is 69 cards so let's uh, get into it I don't care about how I open the pack, so look. Alright, so we got Carvana, Togepi, and a Water Energy. Not bad. Uh, the cards are actually really nice and crispy, which are really nice, so that's, uh, that's a good thing. But, um,. Yeah, let's just keep on uh, opening them. So here's the, the battle card. So let's see, we got we got Venonat, got Butterfree, oh, and we have Metal Energy. Again, crispy cards, crispy, crispy, crispy. And that's a good thing. So. this over there, put this just throw it away, alright so we got an Esper, a Squirtle, and a Chutot, or yeah Chutot. So most of these look like to be commons, um, I did notice on this Butterfree card that it is a rare, I don't know if you can see that or not. Um, but yeah, most of these are, are common, which is cool. So I'm going to put Butterfree over here because it's a rare, even though it's not hollow. But, you know, whatever. It's cool. All right, next one. Oh, hit my camera. What's going on, bud? Why did you do this to me, Pat? There we go. Just garbage. Another card. All right, so we got Ghastly. Licky Licky. And a Tyrogue. And our Licky Licky is our rare. That fat dude. So you're gonna go over there. Alright, let's just keep going, I guess. Uh, of course, of course. Why couldn't you just open correctly? This is a mess. This is gonna be a mess, but you know what? Oh well. Come on, come on. Open oh, it, we go. Throw that over there. Garbage. Alright, another card. Alright, and we got ourselves an Ekans. Ooh, got a reverse hollow. Mr. Welder. And a fairy chain ability. Cool. So uh that's our that's a rare card. And it's another rare. So I'm not really sure what the, the stars are. I believe they're rare or whatever. You know, I, I don't care about the rarity of the cards. I don't really care if they're common, uncommon, whatever. You know, I, I, I like, I just enjoy opening these cards and I think that they're really cool. Um, especially the, uh, the hyper rares and the secret rares and the ultra rares. Like just, there is so much Artwork going on. So we got a Caterpie, 
Cottony, and a triple acceleration energy. Any rare? No. Uncommon and common. But yeah, it, if I do end up finding a card that is, you know, rare, like worth money, and I get a duplicate of it, um, I'd probably keep it. If not, I can sell it. So, uh, we got a Meowth. There we go. We got ourselves an Ultra Rare, which is Gardevoir and Sylveon. And we got a Weeping Bell. Nice. So there's a very pretty card right there. See what I mean about the artwork is that when I was collecting, when I was younger, the artwork was just super simple. But now, it's very uh, unique and very detailed. So that's cool. Nice. So um, with the unified minds, I'm hoping that I'm right and that it is a unified um, minds set uh, for the packs for that tag team box. Um, I am looking for a Keldeon. Keldeon is my favorite artwork from that set and one of my favorite Pokemon. You got Geodude, Porygon, and a Pharaoh. Um, from that from the newer Pokemon um, age, I guess you could say. Um, I, now it would have to be the upcoming Pokemon. My favorite would have to be the um, the Sword Pokemon. I think his name is Zentura or Zentiro or something like that. Okay, back. You're gonna. There. There we go. All right, so we got a Litten. A Froakie and an, a Metal Energy. But yeah, um, I would really love to pull that full art um, Hyper Rare uh, Keldeon. You know, I'm, I'm not really into trainer cards. It's cool to have them, don't get me wrong, but um, for me, trainer cards are just poop, you know. Um, again, I do like um, Pokemon. I've been very big Pokemon fan. I'm also a big Yu-Gi-Oh fan and Digimon fan. Um, card wise, I would probably say Yu-Gi-Oh would have been my second favorite to collect. Um, and then Digimon and all these other ones. So we got a Froakie, we got an Aaron, and we got a Fire Energy. So for a dollar for three cards and you could possibly get cool stuff out of it. That's really, really good. Like, I'm not even gonna lie. Like, I would pay a dollar all the time. But, again, you only get three cards, so it's cool. Alright, so we got Venonat, got a Meowth, and we got a fi uh, Fighting Energy. So, um, again, I hope uh, you guys do enjoy this as much as I enjoy it, you know. I don't do many um, things like this. I thought it'd be cool to do something different on my channel. So, this is what we're doing. So, we got a Jigglypuff, we got a Krabby, and we got an Energy Spinner. Cool, cool, cool. So, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We got like maybe 11. I think I've opened 10 already. That's good. Cool. Hey, again, only for a dollar. Can't beat it. Honestly. So, here we go. Three more cards. We got a Riolu, got an Esper, and a Chip Chip Ice Pick. Any rare? No. Just common and uncommon. What's new? Okay. Moving on, moving on. Slowly but surely, these packs are just are unforgivable. unforgivable. They do not want to open. If there's an easier way, please let me know. Because I'm not going to sit here and deal with that. Alright, so we got a Murkrow. This bird is actually really cool uh, in the regular Pokemon game. We got a Rhydon, or Rhyhorn, sorry, and a Fairy Energy. Again, I. Stopped playing Pokemon after they kind of got repetitive 
after they put out what was it? Um, I want to say it was diamond and pearl, maybe, or gold and silver. Probably gold and silver with uh, Lugia and Ho Oh. All right, we got Pikachu, Salazzle, and Porygon. Oh, and I believe that's a rare. It is. And that's an uncommon, I think. Or that might be rare, I don't know. I think it's uncommon. Again, I could care less about rarities and stuff, because it just, it gets too much of a headache, and I'm not into that, man. Just. I collect them because I like them and I think they're cool, you know, to have cool cards hanging around. We got Tangela and we got a Ultra Force Cardin of Boy, or whatever. Let me see. Yeah, I did say it right. Cardin Boy. Okay, so we're gonna keep going. So, back to what I was saying. Um, I could care less about rarity. Yeah, it's cool to have some super rare cards and stuff, but at the end of the day, they're going to either sit up on my shelf back there, or they're going to sit in my closet in my Pokemon book. I've got a Meltan, Slowpoke, and a Golbat. Man, these, for having 23 packs, like 69 cards. And I got some rares over there, sitting over there. That's cool. That's good. Again, it's only a dollar. Got a Whooper. Got a Cottony. We got a Dodrio. No rarities. All common and uncommon. But again, I guess that's what you get with most of these dollar packs. Unless you're lucky, like I just was, and I pulled um, the Sylveon and... Um, the other one. Alright, so we got a sand dial, we got a grub grubbin, and we got a gloom. Again, all uncommon and common. That's cool though. It's cool. I should have been opening these packs like that from the beginning. That was so easy. Alright, so we got a. Kind of clean that card up a little bit. We got a Meowth. Ooh, we got another one. Gardevoir and Sylveon alternate art. Pretty card. Pretty, pretty, pretty. And we got a Poliwhirl. Nice. See, see what I mean? How intricate the art is? It's just so, like, amazing. Like, it's super cute, super detailed. And just looks great. So put that right there. I do apologize for my camera, um, I had to set it up to where I would be able to get my face and um, the cards into one, but you know what, it is what it is, got a big old mess over there now in my little garbage pile, so we got an Oddish, got a reverse hollow Oddish, with the alt, no, it's the same one. Okay, cool, and we got a fire energy. Nice. So again, hey, three cards, you get really cool stuff for a dollar. Quality of the card is great. Super crispy, at least these are. I don't know if any other stores are different. Um, again, it just, Pokemon has changed so much, and I like it, you know? Okay, so we got a Rhyhorn, Quagsire, an Electromagnetic Radar. Nice. Alright, so this is the last one for Unbroken Bonds for the dollar, general dollar packs. Um, I did get these this tag team box from, I believe it was Walmart, for like 15 bucks. But again, Unified Minds is my favorite set you know as far as the looks of the cards so all right we got a whooper 
Ooh, look at that. And we got a trainer card. Green Exploration. That is so beautiful. Look at that. Look at that hollow pattern. Nice. And we got a Metapod. Meat, meat pod, as most people would like to say. So, out of 69 cards, we got two of the same card with an alternate art and full art trainer. Nice. That's uh, super good looking. I just, I still love the, the hollow pattern on the trainer. All right, so we're gonna put these back here. Hopefully they stay up. Oh, can you see them? I'm not sure. Put those back there like that. All right, now to get into the tin. All right, so I'm gonna sit back here, open this tin up and uh, See what we get. So I believe there is one card in here that you get, which is a hollow, which is which is the Mew and Mewtwo card, and then we get three packs, which they are Unified Minds. Perfect. So here is the metal. Um, chip card thing that it comes with which that is gonna go up on my shelf that is super cool looking um, will you fit back there if I stand you up no nope. okay we'll just put you in front so we have four um, four packs oh, I forgot to take my new Mewtwo card out because you know that's a thing rookie mistake I guess so here's the Mew Mewtwo card that you get in the um, tin which is such a nice card you can look you can see clearly see the hollow hollow pattern on it so you're gonna go back here with my other ones I do not have any sleeves um, I'm gonna have to get some if you guys want to see me open more um, Again, I grew up on Pokemon. I enjoyed it. So, we have one Unified Minds pack, another uni Unified Minds pack. We have Lost Thunder. That's a cool set, too. And we have Evolutions XY. So, we're going to start with the Evolutions XY. If I can get it open. There we go. Again, that whole finger pattern thing that I was doing was um, working out. It was working out. So here's your code. I know a lot of people collect these. I don't have time to play online. You know, I make videos half the time. Um, don't know the card trick. So uh, we're just going to... You know what? No, I think it's... Three. We'll try three. I think it's three. Four. Let's go four. Okay. We'll do four. We got a old school Starmie. Nice. We got a Kakuna. We got a Potion. We got a Venusaur Spirit Link. We got a Vulpix. We got a Sand Shrew. Got an Onyx, Magikarp, an Energy, and a Reverse Hollow Machoke. So these are the cards that I grew up on. I remember buying my first, um, I guess you could say, packs of base set. I think they're they're what what they refer to as. Um, so, yeah, that was that was cool. So we got a reverse hollow machoke, and what was our our was Starmie? No, 
I guess Starmie was the, uh... Starmie was the, uh, rare, I would assume. Yeah, Starmie was the, the rare. So, that's that. Alright, now we're going into some Lost Thunder. And again, I apologize for me having to do this and stuff. Just the way my camera's set up. Not, you know, it's... I guess you can see people problems. I don't have time and the money to go out and buy a camera. And... Okay, so... Another pack. Here's a code. Have it. Have fun. Where did I put all the, uh... The Q codes. Did I, I didn't put them there. Where did I put them? Alright, well, whatever. So, this one... I am not sure... I want to say it's maybe, um, three. think like that all right so we have a uh, metal energy I think I did this right I'm not sure we've got a sable eye got a electro power we've got a zatu a bruxish a dedene cyndaquil wormpole Poplio, got a reverse hollow Whitney, and our rare is a Configurus. <laughs> itchy, itchy, itchy. So we got reverse hollow and our non hollow rare. So cool, that's not bad. So now we're getting into my favorite set, which is Unified Minds. Oh! I found where I put all the cue cards. Alright. So I believe this one is four to the front, from the back. Alright, let's see. If you'd open for me. There we go. Alright. So. Ooh. I see a white card, which is a good sign. Here you go. You can have that. Don't use it. So it should be four, right? One, two, three, four. And the first one should be an energy. Yes, so I did that right. All right, so we got a psychic energy. We've got a why not? Archin. We've got a lampin. Finon. Probably saying these wrong. Pokemon names have gotten ridiculous. We got an Alolan Grimer. We got a Carablast. Oh, you didn't see that. We got a Fletchlin. Henedge. Or Honage. We got an Archopes. Archiopes. Reverse Hollow. And we got a Haxorus. Hollow. Nice. Very pretty. Even the Reverse Hollows are pretty. Even, even they have, like, remarkable texture. Just the printing on them. But with the Hollows. You have that rainbowness, the extra rainbowness. So you're going back here, buddy. Right in the back. Come on, light. Don't do that. I don't see that was too not enough light. Alright, and our last pack of Unified Minds. Hopefully we can get something awesome out of this, because if not. Again, who cares? It's it's about the uh, the pack openings. Come on, there we go. Rip it open. No, nope. we didn't get anything. Here you go. You can have that. And um, yeah. So four. Our first card should be an energy, water energy. Nice. Got a re reset stamp. Electric. Is that a fish? 
it is, no, it's an eel. Got a fairy Dedenne, which is really good looking card. Got a Magmar, got a Cottony, got a Snow Runt, Tynamo, a Metatite, Reverse Hollow Metatite, and a Lucario for our on Hollow Rare. So, with that said, I think we had uh, some good pulls. So, I am going to line these up from nicest to, I guess, uh, set wise. So here we have Green's Exploration. We have Gardevoir and Sylveon, alternate art. Gardevoir and Sylveon, regular art. I could have them backwards, I'm not 100% sure. Uh, we have the Mew Mewtwo. And we have a Haxorus and our Machoke. So, um, hope you guys enjoyed. That was my card opening. I think that me pulling these cards was very nice. I got really nice ones, in my opinion. Again, I don't like trainer cards, but you know, it's cool to pull one. You know, it's a very pretty card. I love the texture pattern on it. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's like um, swirly. It's cool though. So. I'm gonna leave that video here. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. Uh, make sure to hit that notification bell so you get notified when I upload, and we'll catch you in the next one. Later.